Hello, welcome back to the channel. For today's reading, we're going to be reading about uh, the relationship of um, Song Jung Ki and Katie Lewis Sanders. Um, I believe uh, Song Jung Ki is a Korean actor and Katie Lewis uh, Sanders is a British actress. Um, I, I asked the cards what will be their future relationship be like? Will they last? So those are, you know, the questions I uh, asked the cards. Um, so we are going to be reading about them today. So for this reading, I'm going to um, use two deck of decks of cards. Um, the first deck is the Lenormand cards, the white ones, and uh, the tarot cards, the colorful ones. I'm mainly going to read the Lenormand cards as a combination of cards per column. Um, and the tarot cards are there to clarify and give context of the reading. So um, there are two parts of my reading. Uh, the first part is we're going to be looking at the meaning of each card that, that was picked. And um, the uh, second part will be to combine the cards, the liniment cards, along with the tire cards per column. All right. So before I start the reading, I would appreciate that uh, if you could like this video and subscribe to the channel to, you know, to help out with the algorithm of YouTube and to have more readings to come in this channel. And let me know if you have some requests, uh, like, write the, type them down on the comment section below. All right, let's start with the reading. So let's start with the first row. Um, let's start from left to right. The first card, the top row, is a tower that signifies uh, the com a company, a corporation, uh, perhaps an agency that they work for um, as actors. Uh, it could be a film company that they work for on the film. Um, it could also mean that, you know, in other, other meanings of this uh, card is a big towering tower or isolation. It could also mean school, an institution, government. So those are the other meanings of this uh, card. Let's move on to the second card, which is the fox. The fox, uh, there are two meanings that are not related, two meanings that are not related. The first meaning is... Uh, Signifies work or job. Uh, so the other meaning is about cunning, trickery, deceit, lies. But we are going to be, um, you know, uh, perhaps we're going to do both as well, this meaning. So anyway, uh, let's move on to the third card in the, uh, in the row here. Uh, we have uh, the key. The key signifies openness, uh, a solution, you know, success. Yes card. Um, let's move on to the second row. We have the obstacle or the mountain. Sorry. <laughs> it means an obstacle, delays, uh, an enemy. Something's blocking, a huge thing that's blocking your way. All right. Um, the, the next card and the second row is the heart meets love, passion. Um, so that's the heart. And the man there, that's the third card in the second row. Uh, this could be um, Jung Ki or Sung Jung Ki uh, showed up in the in the the spread, and let's see what's his um, role on the spread on the second part of the reading. All right, let's move on to the last row. Uh, the first card in the last row is the crown. Um, if I'm reading for a leader. It means uh, spread presidency, or it's president, or it could be a monarch or a king um, of country or a leader. But if if a celebrity has this card, it means that they they are a king or an idol, the top of their game, and their uh, chosen field because they do have followers, they have fans. Uh, like 
like uh, you know a monarchy they have followers as well right second card in the bottom row is the um coffin means ending could be mourning or suffering uh, those are the meaning of the coffin uh, it also means transformation um so and the last card of the spread is the 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 ring it signifies marriage engagement proposal commitment uh, contract so those are the meanings of each card that were picked or letterman card that were picked let's move on to the second part of the reading uh there, let's start with the first column first column we have the tower the mountain and the crown it could be read that uh, their agency uh, will have some obstacles uh, regarding their the the status or their their famous status or idol status um, I'm not really I don't know the it could be because I'm Asian or part of Asia and we're really into Korean dramas. Even on Netflix uh, has a lot of Korean shows. So I'm I'm aware of, uh, I, I know, Sung Jun Ki and even his show, um, Descendants of the Sun, was that the title? There's actually, a, um, it was a dub in our language, our native language. So he's quite famous in Asia, uh, but I'm not that that aware of Katie um, as a British actress. I'm not really sure. I have not Googled her, the shows or the films that he, she acted. Maybe I've seen her shows, but I'm not aware of her. You know, she she is not a a, a star yet. You know. Because I know big stars, you know, I know people, if your show are good and if you are really a star, your name would pop up. Because I read celebrities, <laughs> I read cards about the celebrities, most all of all, I mean, most of our, of my videos and this channel is about reading celebrities. So I'm so aware of, you know, mainstream media and Hollywood um, celebrities, but I'm not that, that familiar with her i just her name just popped up because she is in a relationship or with song jun ki so this first uh, column could be about song jun ki um so it could be that the tower or the the agency um We'll have some sacrifices because we have the hangman um, paired with the tower. Um, there are going to be delays or obstacles because we have the mountain uh, because of indecision or difficult decisions. So because the mountain is uh, paired with the two of uh, swords and um, this would result to, you know, uh, the this indecision is about being a star, being an idol, um, or expanding his status of being an idol. Because he's, he's definitely one of the top male actors in Korea. So the expansion there is, uh, I said expansion of his, his status or his, you know, his fame, because the crown is paired with the uh, three of wands. So that's the first uh, column. It could be that maybe his attention and his priorities is to be with Katie. Um, and they live in different countries, right? I believe it's, if his work is mainly in Korea and he has to travel to England to visit her, to be with her, or Katie has to go to Korea to be with him or go somewhere else. So it's it really is going to take up his time and effort. And he's not going to be, um, you know, because if he's working on a project, there's there his time is, is, is scheduled to finish that project. 
So yeah, and perhaps this agency is going through some sacrifices, some schedule adjustments, some projects that will not be accepted. And because of some of, you know, this, this difficulty, difficult choices of uh, having time to travel and to be with your loved ones and be able to continue to grow as an actor, expand, meaning expand perhaps other actors like um, we have uh, we have another actor that I actually um, read, uh, or, you know, in my previous video, who has joined the Marvel movies. Um, that's Park Seo Joon. Um, he's now expanding to Hollywood. Perhaps he has that vision, but um, you know, his priorities are somewhere else. So thus, we have some sacrifices and indecision or stalemate. So yeah, that's the first column. Let's go to the second column. Uh, second column, we have, uh, uh, like I mentioned earlier, the meaning of a job. Um, boxes means job or work. So if you have the fox, a heart, and the the coffin, I would read it as a job that you love ends or some someone at work the love and the love that you love ends or the love interests that's uh, you know maybe part of the job ends that could be it so let's look at it paired with the tarot so that we can have some context perhaps figure out what really it are what are, was the meaning of this uh, column so the fox is paired with the two of cups two of cups mean union you see hands there joining together so a uh, partnership to become one so it could be that there is someone at work uh, that they have entanglement with or in a relationship with, um, that they are emotionally attached with. We, could, we have the heart. Could, there's, there may be a relationship uh, that's related to or started when they are working with each other. But somehow um, this love... Of someone, maybe we have the five of coins or five of pentacles paired with the heart. Maybe this person is not as well off or financially um, stable, or it's someone could be insecure. Um, that will end because of the coffin, and this ending was because of the. Um, the queen of wands, queen of wands is someone that is determined, um, courageous, and joyful, natural, natural born leader. So I'm not sure if this relationship is talking about Katie or Jun Ki, because a queen or king that shows up in the card may be related to, could be defined, it, it's, it could be a man or a woman. Um, but as long as their characteristics are there, if, if Katie is someone fiery or someone determined and courageous and could lead and, and, and joyful, um, this could be associated to her. But this, if this character is uh, Junki, then it could be Junki. But whatever, if there are entanglement with someone at work, that somehow ends because we have the coffin, right? Because if we're going to talk about the fox as a trickster or it lies in deceit, uh, it's, it's, it would not, it will be difficult to, to interpret. So I usually, for me, when I read the card, the fox is a job card. So I'm going to stick to it. You know, I'm stick to that. Um, I'm just saying some meaning because perhaps your interpretation may be different, you know. 
and I cannot really ask the, the celebrities if uh, you know to to confirm or deny uh, what we see in the cards. So those are the interpretations that I have. So let's move on to the third column. The third column here is a, I think this is a wonderful column uh, for a romantic reading, you know. So we have the key, the man, and the ring. So key again is openness, success. So uh, maybe um, uh, Jun Ki is so open with uh, the commitment, his commitment towards uh, Katie. Um, the key is paired with the Knight of Cups. If you can see there, there's a, a horseman bringing bringing flowers. So it's, it's open to romance, you know, um, showing off his his admiration, his love for Katie. And he, uh, this man, is paired with the two of uh, ones, which means planning. So he's planning something related to the ring or their marriage or proposal um, and commitment. Uh, this ring is really, um, this commitment translate into action because the ring is paired with the king of knights. Sorry, knights of wands, not the king. Sorry about that. Uh, the, the ring is paired with the knight of wands, which is, um, more of action um, so there's really action um, over this commitment this this is not just saying or a lip service that you just say I love you I want to be with you I promise to this do this and that but his his commitment translate into action and that's why there's such, such a positive vibe a uh, positive column because it's quite you know uh, good that you see a man translate his promises and commitment to action. So yeah, um, so that's the reading for uh, June Key and Katie. Um, uh, it's it. There's going to be obstacles when it comes to um, their their you know their the work there's going to be some delays if they're going to be in this relationship it's if jun ki chooses a korean woman who lives in the same city as he is his work will not be as you know there's gonna be no problem because he could go home and the woman's there or you have the same if the work is if that woman korean woman also worked and then when she comes home He's there, but when you're with someone who is from another country, it's quite difficult. So there's going to be sacrifices there. About the second column, if uh, this was a relationship prior to them getting together, um, there's definitely an ending. If there is like second thoughts while, you know, overlapping, dating someone, because, you know, Western people, they date several people you know before they decide to be be exclusive with someone that i've read if you're dating around you know or this could be a past lover um when at work but this relationship ends which is a good thing for both of them i guess and then, um, of course, what we see in the third column is the commitment of Jun Ki. Um, you know, there, he has plans, he is, is taking action. So he's really proactive over this relationship. So, you know, hopefully they would last and hopefully there, whatever obstacle that they have in the relationship, they can overcome. Um, if, you know, um, I wish them luck and happiness in their love life. So that's the reading for day, today. Uh, again, this is for So Jun Ki and um, Katie Lewis Sanders. Saunders. Hope I pronounced those names correctly. 
Um, so I hope you like this reading. I'd appreciate if you like the video and subscribe to the channel and share this uh, well, to others who are interested in the, these celebrities. And thank you again for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.